Originally, Unity created external assets for each material, as you can see in our materials folder. This meant that the FBX did not reflect the structure of the file and the assets folder would be populated with materials and textures and eventually contain redundant files and complicate source control and collaboration. But from Unity 2017.2 we've included a materials tab and you can preserve embedded materials in the FBX by selecting the use embedded materials. So from the drop down here, uh, like so, and I'm going to unremap those so that it will preserve them and apply. You can see that the materials are now embedded in the FBX. Now that enables you to support round tripping. So we can output these and go back into Max or Maya with those materials, uh, which is very handy. But of course the um, legacy behavior is still accessible in the materials tab here. So to finish off, we're going to look at what we've achieved. We've outlined some best practices, we've set up some normal calculations, we've been animating and importing cameras and lights, animating visibility, keyframing a floating ship with a new workflow, exporting PBS Stingray materials into Unity and covering the materials tab. So now I can enable some post effects uh, on here um, and hit play and our scene is complete. Thanks for watching.